Hey Steelers Nation! It's Tuka here, bringing you the latest hot news and analyses straight from the universe of our beloved Pittsburgh Steelers. If you're passionate about football and want to stay updated on everything happening with the Steelers, you're in the right place. Don't forget to leave that like, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell so you don't miss any updates. Shall we go together? In today's video, we have a topic that's boiling behind the scenes in the NFL and promises to ignite even more discussions among fans. The arrival of Justin Fields and the fierce competition for the Steelers' starting quarterback position, involving none other than Russell Wilson. But before we dive into this analysis, have you left your like today? It really helps the channel grow. The scenario in Pittsburgh has become dramatically interesting in recent weeks. After the Justin Fields era was officially ended by the Chicago Bears, our Pittsburgh Steelers opened the doors for the quarterback, marking a new chapter in his career already in his fourth season in the NFL. And as if Fields' arrival wasn't enough, the Steelers also welcomed Russell Wilson, heating up the competition for the starting QB spot. Mike Tomlin, our chief strategist, has already hinted that, although Wilson seems to be ahead, Fields will have every chance to prove his worth and fight for the starting position. We're talking about an epic battle between two respected QBs, my friends. But what makes Fields such a strong candidate for this position? David Carr, former quarterback and analyst for the NFL Network, has no doubts. Justin Fields will be the starter in Week 1. According to Carr, our offense under the command of Arthur Smith doesn't require a vast repertoire of experiences to function well, being perfectly adaptable to field style, especially with RPO plays where he can use his agility and speed to unbalance the opposing defense. And I agree with Carr. Fields has that explosion, that ability to transform the game with his legs, in addition to his arm. He brings a dynamic that can be very well explored by our offensive scheme. And, let's be honest, who wouldn't want to see a quarterback who can run as well as he can pass the ball? But this saga has another interesting chapter, the compensation that the Chicago Bears will receive for the trade. If Fields takes the field for more than 51% of the snaps in 2024, the Bears improve their draft pick from a 6th to a 4th round. So, even Bears fans have reasons to keep an eye on Pittsburgh. What do you think about this competition between Fields and Wilson? Who do you think should be the starter? Leave your comment below, we'd love to hear your opinion. And if you liked the video, share it with your football fan friends. It really helps our channel grow and bring more analyses to you. Well, that's all for today, folks. Remember, Tuka News Steelers is your channel for all news, analyses, and opinions about our beloved team. Stay tuned for more updates, and let's continue this conversation in the comments. Until next time, 